Hey guys, and I don't exactly know what I'm gonna talk about today, but it's going to be a weird one, so I'm bringing you along. So what's weird about today? Well, I had to launch something at work like super early. So I had to wake up before eight o'clock, before seven o'clock even, um, to get this thing done. And now I'm working from home at the beginning part of the day. Then I'm gonna go into work. And then I'm going to meet with Jason, my partner on the project that I've been working on. And after that, I may have some really big news, kind of news, I don't know, announcement that is really exciting for me and is really exciting for him and could be really exciting for you guys. So stay tuned for that. All right, so we're all showered now, clean, got some work done this morning, ate a good breakfast, and now it's time to go to work. So I will see you guys when I get there. Leah just wants to come to work. Hey guys, so I just finished work and recording now and I just met with my partner and the lighting's terrible because I'm in my car and I'm in a parking garage and I'm really sorry about that. But I am so excited to get home so that I can get in better lighting and tell you guys some really exciting news for me. My partner and I just discussed something that could be life-changing and I'm really excited to share that news with you guys. All right, so I'm back home now and I just wanted to share a little bit of news with you guys. And it's not the most exciting news right now, but it could turn into something really big in the future. So I went into this meeting with my partner who's building this app with me. And if you don't know, I've been working on this little side project for a while now, and I haven't made a ton of good progress on it, but I've made a ton of progress in learning the technologies we're using to build it. Anyways, I wanted to talk to him about something called Y Combinator. And if you don't know what that is, it's a startup accelerator out in San Francisco. And basically what they do is they invest an amount of money into startups. And then you go out to San Francisco for three months and you learn a bunch of stuff and you meet a bunch of people. And it's just a really good way to kind of kick off a business in the tech scene. So there are a bunch of these like startup accelerators out there and Y Combinator is probably the most famous. I know Dropbox and Twitch were started there or went through the program at some point. And it's just a really awesome opportunity and it's a long shot right thousands of people apply and last year they took 105 for their last like group of startups so it's a long shot but I'm excited to say that we're going to try and the application is due October 3rd and this does two things one for sure and one potentially and one long term and one short term so in the short term it gives me a hard deadline and I work better with deadlines I, it gives me pressure and makes me do things on time so I don't procrastinate because I'm a pretty big procrastinator. And in the long term, the possible thing that it does is give me a jumping off point. And it will introduce me to a bunch of people who I'd probably never have the opportunity to meet otherwise. And it gives you a little bit of funding and it just is a really good opportunity. And I'm excited to say that we are going to be applying. We hope to have an MVP of what we're building by the 1st of September and apply that first week of September to give them plenty of time to review the application. And I'm just really excited to share this process with you guys. And I'll be making videos weekly about our process and our progress and how everything is going. Oh, one more thing. And by the way, I wrote a blog post that's going up on Climb Credit, who are the people who financed my coding bootcamp journey. And that should be going up at the same time around -ish, uh, this blog vlog is posted. So if it's up, I will put the link in the description. And if it's not up yet, I will put it up as soon as it's there. But it's the blog for Climb Credit and you should check that out. So that's all I have today. If you have any questions, feel free to leave them down in the comments below. And if you know anybody or know anything about Y Combinator that you think I should know, feel free to leave that down there. Tips are always greatly appreciated. I hope you liked this video. If you did, hit that thumbs up because they are super awesome and they make me smile. And if for any reason you're not subscribed yet, feel free to do that and follow along in the journey. I hope you guys have a wonderful rest of your day and I will talk to you again very soon. Bye.